Right. Now then, this is the 827 from Worthing, see? Well, come pay attention, Moby. There you are, and it's travelling at 80 hundred miles an hour. There you are, clickety click, clickety clack, clickety click, clickety click. Now it's going through a tunnel, see? Clickety click, clickety clack, clickety click, clickety clack. Now it's going round the bend. Uh, George, the only thing going round the bend is you. <laughs> I was uh, entertaining the goldfish, Mildred. <laughs> Where did you get this train set from? I went swaps with a little fella next door. What, Tristram? Yeah. And what did you give him? He was quite happy. Ah, uh, George, what did you give him? Gave him an old tyre. Take it back! <laughs> oh, I can't, Mildred. We went keeps. Oh, dear. <laughs> God, no, come on, pack the whole thing up and take it back. Oh, God. I never had a train set when I was a kid. Woo-woo! <laughs> My mother is due here at any moment, George. I do not want her to find you woo-hooing all over the table. Your mother coming here? Yes. Well, it's only ten months since she came here last. She's making her happy of this. <laughs> George, my mother is coming. And this time, I do not want you to disconnect the doorbell. Well, I'll be honest, Mildred, I don't like her. Yeah, only because she beat you at arm wrestling. No, no she didn't. <laughs> No, I, I gave in because she was turning purple. Uh, uh, she beat you. Now, come on, pack that away neatly. Stupid box. Anyway, what time's she going home? George, she hasn't even got here yet. She's turning funny. You know what I mean? Last time she came here, she hung her hat on me and said hello to the all stand. Oh. <laughs> George is getting old. That's why she's strange. What is your excuse? <laughs> oh. Daddy going to decorate my room as well? No, I don't think so. Why is he getting you wallpaper and I'm not? Oh, boy. It started already, Geoffrey. What? Oh, good grief. Uh, I'll phone an ambulance. No, not that. <laughs> this. He's getting a bit J-E-A-L-U-S. J-E-A-L-O-U-S. <laughs> Thank you. He wants new wallpaper, too. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. One room is enough. Come in, look at me. Paint my hair. Oh, yes. Yeah. I thought we'd agreed on eggshell finish. I'll get it. <laughs> oh, good afternoon, Mr. Formar. I, um, I brought this uh, train set for Tristram. He's already got one. Yes, I know. This is it. And, uh... George would like his tyre back. Yes. Um, think you'd better speak to Anne. She may understand you. Oh, right. oh I see Arsenal won on Saturday. <laughs> Excel finish. Mummy oh, says I can stir the paint for you. Fine. Um, if you'd like to go. No, Tristram. Uh, yeah. Tristram, leave it alone. Oh, <laughs> can I come in, dear? Oh, hello, Mildred. Would you like a cup of coffee? Oh, lovely. Um, Tristram accidentally left this behind at our house. <laughs> Kids, do you know he turned up with a tatty old tyre the other day? Oh, fancy. <laughs> oh. oh, wallpaper. Yes, for the baby's room. Oh, you can get a decorator in to do it. Probably, but not until Geoffrey's finished doing it himself. <laughs> <laughs> Would you like a sardine and bacon sandwich? <laughs> I see your bell's working this time, Humphrey. Yeah, what? <laughs> George. Oh, is that what you call it? Where's my Mildred? Well, oh, she's a uh, pop next door, taking the train. Oh, you're so lazy, you young people. <laughs> now, now, are you glad to see me back? I will be. Yeah. <laughs> How are you keeping then? Oh, I'm not long for this world. Oh, good, good. <laughs> Here, Dr. McLaren wants to put my leg in a medical textbook. Why, well, have you got a bookmark? <laughs> He says there's only another leg like it in the old country. And right. here, I've got that one as well. Yeah, well put it away. Ah, <laughs> uh, 
It's a sad thing when your body starts to wear out and your mind's still as sharp as ever, Humphrey. <laughs> George. I didn't hear it. <laughs> now, I'm George. Oh, isn't that a bit confusing? Oh, George, George. Oh, oh, she's here, Mildred. Hello, Mother. Oh, how are you, then? I'm not long for this world. <laughs> yes, well... But... Oh, here. I got a letter for you, Mildred. What? Came some weeks ago. All the way from America. America? Mm. That's in the USA. Yes, <laughs> yeah. Uh, Mother, it's already opened. Yes. I accidentally got it caught in the steam from the kettle. <laughs> Here. It's from one of your old boyfriends. Ooh. She was a terror with the Yanks before she got stuck with you. <laughs> but Lee Kennedy? Yes, from what? the air base. You remember Flight Sergeant? Oh, Lee! Oh. You never went short when he was around. <laughs> <laughs> Nylons, bananas, chewing gum. Oh. Here, was he the one with the crew cut? No, that was right. a tall one. Oh, ginger air. No, that was the one before. What, moustache? No. no. Oh, Struth, how many of them were there? I demand to see that letter, Mildred. Uh, George, this is personal and private. Yes. He wants to see her again. Hey? Oh, he's coming over here on business. Thought it'd be nice to have a little reunion. Dinner at the Dorchester next Saturday. Ooh. Aren't you going to read it? <laughs> Would you think I need to? Well, throw away, Mildred. Come on. All right, then, George. There it's you are. A, you are a happily married woman. Uh, yes, George, I am a married woman. <laughs> <laughs> well, now, Mother, what was the weather like in Dagenham? It was all sunshine in those days. Yes, dear, I'm talking about now. Oh, my Muriel was a beauty then. Yeah, it wasn't always sunshine, either. <laughs> <laughs> You're back. Did you take Mother all the way to the station? Yeah. She lost her teeth in the sidecar when we went over the cobblestone. <laughs> <laughs> oh, charming. Hey, you're going to laugh, aren't you? Yeah, I suppose so. All right, what are you doing? I'm just looking through our old photographs, George. Oh, yeah, you're looking for that Yank fellow, aren't you? Lee, what's name? Not really, no. I often have a look yeah, through Mildred, these. I want to see that letter. Oh, all right, then. Go on. All right. Miss M. Tremble? That was my maiden name, George. Mm -hmm. I haven't been a Tremble since I married you. <laughs> oh, look, yes, this is a page. Look, George. 1940... Uh, um... Well, he's got a nerve. Oh, don't be so silly. Oh, look. Oh, there's a picture of all the girls that used to work with me at the canteen. There's Kitty and Gladys. Cool. Six of us. And 300 American airmen. What? <laughs> at the base. And you used to work at it? I didn't have to. <laughs> oh, look, that's it. That's him, that's Lee. He's black. Oh, <laughs> does. That's a negative. Mm. No, no, look, look. That's him, and, 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 and that's me next to him. Yeah, well, he won't be like that now. Probably fat and bald. <laughs> Not necessarily. Well, let's face it, Mildred, the years haven't been kind to you. Oh, thank you. I can still get into the same dresses. Mind you, I have to. I can't afford any new ones. Yeah, well, you're not the only one, you know. I've had a few flings in my time. Gloria Rumbold. Oh? Gloria Rumbold. I went out with her for five years. You told me I was the first. Well, you were for that sort of thing. <laughs> Oh, I mean, those days a man had to respect a girl, didn't he? I mean, th this uh, Lee was name, he was probably the same with you. Oh, yeah, quite, yes. Mm. Are you you going to meet him? Uh, well, George, um, I don't know. I, I, I haven't decided yet. I'm your husband, Mildred, and I forbid it. Oh, well, dear, of course that settles it. I'm going. <laughs>
it's dinner time, Obi. There they are. That's the way. I'll say one thing for you, good company. <laughs> well, George? Well, what? I went to the beauty parlour this afternoon. Oh, yeah. Shut, were they? <laughs> No, George, no. I am not going to let you upset me. Not today. Yeah, well, the last couple of days you've done... What's that pong? <laughs> it's my new perfume. It is called Desire. Oh. Uh. Yes, well, it doesn't work miracles. <laughs> it's dark. It... <laughs> what have you done with your chest? Nothing. <laughs> Yeah, you have it, sort of. Uh... <laughs> ah, so that's where my socks went. <laughs> George, I have bought a slightly padded bra. I see. You've never bought a slightly padded bra for me. Well, you can have this one when I finish with it. <laughs> I know what you're trying to do. You're trying to make me jealous. Well, it won't work. I'm not jealous. Go off with this yank of yours. Enjoy yourself. I don't care. All right, I will. You're not going. Oh, George. <laughs> now, come on. It's just a little social drink for old time's sake. I mean, in the odd 20 years we've been married, when was the last time I went out on my own? Our wedding anniversary dinner. Yeah. <laughs> and that was only because you wouldn't come with me. Yeah, well, there was a dance match on, wasn't there? Oh, <laughs> George, the point is, I don't make a habit of it. Now, now I am going. Right. Uh, I may not enjoy myself. I may feel guilty. I may spend the entire evening thinking of you, sitting here, all alone, but I very much doubt it. Aye. Right. We know where we stand. Yeah. Yeah. We know where we stand. <laughs> what sauce for the goose is another man's meat. Mm. <laughs> now then, here somewhere. Ah, yeah, here it is. Right. Now then, let's see. Ah, yeah. Gloria Rumbold. <laughs> right, clap them. Two, three, seven. No, two, three, seven. Is she still there, that is? Mm. Sometimes a bit... Oh, hello. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, could you tell me if Miss Gloria Rumbold is still at this address? Well, that address. Yeah. She is? Oh, oh, good. Well, could I speak to... Oh, uh, well, do you know when she might be back? Uh, uh, Roper. George Roper. Yeah, yeah, I'm an old friend of hers, yeah. Yeah, we used to... You're not her husband, are you? <laughs> Her mother. Oh, oh, sorry, 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 sorry. Yeah. Uh, oh. oh, yes, I could do that. It's, uh, hold on, it's a 1712325, yeah. Uh, did you, have you any idea when she might be back? Uh, oh, I see. Yeah, right. Uh, well, bye-bye. Mm. Right, one down, none to go. <laughs> right, so we set the points like this. And we put the train at the station like this, you see? Can I have a turn? In a minute, in a minute. <laughs> so it's pretty realistic. These carriages are filthy. I just want to drive the train. What? Good God, no. He's a porter. You'd have a strike on your hands. <laughs> Lean him against a wall. Uh, here we go. There. Chip, 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 chip. Tristram, what's this tyre doing under your bed? Yeah. That's not a tyre, it's a space station. Well, what's this space station doing under your bed? Mr. Oker went swaps with me for my train set. He what? <laughs> right, well, I think I'll draw three. One, two, a oh. whole. <laughs> right. right, well, let's see what you need, Moby. <laughs> Oh, yeah, a pair of tens, yeah, yeah, well, I'd stick with that if I were you. Yeah, and possibly the ace, eh? Oh, excuse me. Mr. Roper. Oh, come in, son. I could do with a bit of a friendly company. Uh, I have merely come to return this space station, this tyre. Mr. Roper. I have simply come to return this. Well, yeah, about time too. Uh, do you want a beer? What? A beer and a bit of a friendly chat. Friendly? You and me? <laughs> yeah, that's right. Sit down. <clears throat> yeah, well, I mean, after all, you've got to be neighbourly, haven't you? Not... <laughs> there we are, it. I don't know, women. What? Hey, women. Uh, what, what, what about them? Well, you give them the best years of your life, and what happens? First opportunity, they go gallivanting off with another man. Oh. <laughs> you know what I mean? What happened to love and loyalty, eh? 
keeping thee only unto one another. Hello? Who? Gloria. Oh, oh, Gloria. <laughs> oh, hello. Uh, yeah, you, you got me a message then. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, George. Yeah, George, yeah, George Roper. Uh, R-O-P-E, Roper, yeah. yeah. That's right, yeah. Oh, it's been a couple of years. 1951. <laughs> yeah, you know, George, George, big shock of red hair. <laughs> Drain pipes, uh, brothel creepers. Yeah. <laughs> the car, no, uh, yeah. How have you been keeping? Oh, good, good. Here, listen, uh, are you doing anything tonight? Oh, oh right, well, uh, uh, do you fancy coming out for a pint? <laughs> <laughs> You, you know, that pub we used to meet in, the Ship and Shovel. Yeah. <laughs> oh, good, yeah. Well, it's, it's only seven o'clock, yeah? Uh, uh, oh, well, tell you what, we, we could wear a flower in our buttonhole. Yeah, yeah hey, a tulip. Yeah. <laughs> right, yeah, uh, seven o'clock then. Yeah. Roper, George Roper. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's right. Uh, right then. Bye bye, Gloria. <laughs> <laughs> Wrong number. <laughs> I mustn't stand here chatting to you all night. You see your own way up, don't you? The door's at the top of the stairs. Two dry martinis. Hi, honey. Uh, I'm looking for a friend. You found one! <laughs> What's your name? Oh, no, no, no. You, you don't understand. You see, uh, Lee Kennedy. Well, sit down, Lee. <laughs> Mommy Shoemaker from Chicago. I'm in surgical appliances. Oh, I am sorry. Oh, dear. Oh, oh, uh, uh, Lee? Mildred. Oh! Oh, and this is uh, Mervyn Shoemaker from Chicago. Hi. <laughs> oh, the hell with it. Uh, Mildred, Mildred... Uh, 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 Roper. Knee tremble. Ah, uh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> so you're married? Uh, well, uh, yes. <laughs> Let's have a drink before we go in, Oh, huh? right, yes. I booked a private room. A pri <laughs> private room? <laughs> <laughs> you still got it, you little devil. You know. <laughs> no, no, I never married. Well, I never seemed to be time, you know, yeah. what with the oil business and the banks. <laughs> the oil business and the banks. Mm. Oh, yes, quite. <laughs> Well, fancy remembering me after all these years. Oh, those days at the base. <laughs> those were the good days, Mildred. Yes, they were. <laughs> Got any gum, chum? Well, not on me. Uh, but oh, and, oh no. No, no, no. no, you remember, that's what we used to say. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yes. Well, anyway, when I knew I was coming over, I just had to hold this little reunion. Oh. Now, you can call me an old fool if you like. Oh, you're but... not old. <laughs> oh, you're not a fool either, no. <laughs> no, I... I must admit, Lee, that when I got your letter, when well, I oh, thought that like it was... Oh, it looks like they're starting to arrive. Is that Gladys? It is. Gladys! Lee! <laughs> <laughs> oh, you haven't changed a bit. Oh, go on. I saw Kitty in the loo. Yeah. She's tarting herself up for oh, you. Oh, great. Come and sit down. Mildred! Oh, well, I never... All oh, the old gang from the air base. Yeah, I booked a private room. Just the 20 of us. Oh. <laughs> Oh, we're going to have lots of laughs tonight, eh? <laughs> yes. Sam again, is it, Squan? Uh, no, not just for the moment. Um, I'm waiting for a friend. Oh, I don't know if you've seen her. Uh, slim girl, longest blonde hair, quietly spoken. <laughs> Doesn't ring a bell. <clears throat> hello, hello, hello. <laughs> 
tonight. <laughs> Hello, Grandad. How's your belly off the spots, Jan? <laughs> Hello, lovey. Evening, Laura. Come on, Sid, get your finger out. Large vodka. Coming up. <laughs> Phew. That's a relief. Doesn't half take it out of a girl working down the massage parlour? <laughs> Never growing there, you know. So, say, matter of fact, I'm waiting for a friend. There's a lot of it about tonight. That's what he just said. Oh. <laughs> it was there a minute ago. <laughs> George. You're back early? Yes. You have a good time? Oh, marvellous. Oh, he was just as handsome as ever. We had a private room, candlelight, wine. The two of you? Yes. And 18 other people. <laughs> <laughs> he invited half the base. Well, I'll see. Well, aren't you going to have a good laugh? I wouldn't do that, Mildred. Must have been a big disappointment for you. What? Well, let's face it, Mildred. You, life moves on. You, you can't go back. At least we have each other. It may not be much, but we've got to make the best of it, haven't we? <laughs> <laughs> and it's you, me, and Moby yeah. against the world. Yeah. Oh, George. And do you um, do you fancy an early night, Mildred? Oh yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. Right, let's go then. Right. I did think of you tonight, George, really. I thought of you, Mildred. I thought of no one else. Did you really? Oh. Yes. What? Oh. It's for you, George. Somebody waiting for you at the pub. A Gloria Rumbold. <laughs> oh, dear 